WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of well, a drizzly, but yet sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your uh, 11 a.m. update, and currently we have, uh, well, most of the U.S. indices trading to the upside. All the sectors in the S&P 500 are. The only uh, uh, indice that is not trading to the upside is the transportation industry. It's off 87 points. Dow's up 215, six tenths. S&P's at 45 points, 1%, 1.5% 1 1 for the NASDAQ 100, four tenths for the uh, Russell, that's seven points, 1.5% for the semis, 52 points there. You've got gold trading out at 1923, that's up $5 and change. Silver's up 10 cents. Printed out at 22.90. Lights recruit is up 86 pennies. 70.72 is the print there. Natural gas up six cents. 30 treasury. Printed out at 126.22. That is up 17 ticks. Let's take a look at that nine panel market update chart. Yes, mini upper left hand soaps. That's not the nine panel market update chart, but this is. Upper left-hand side, you got the ES Mini uh, tagging uh, the top of its uh, daily profile, 44.75. We're trading at 44.80. It's trading into a prior swing point out here from uh, from uh, June the 16th. Uh, that we likely have seen the extent of the rally today. Spot volatility is below its 50-day expense moving average. It's below yesterday's low. That is a bullish signal for the S&P 500. The NQ still consolidating with inside its profile. It's now tackling the bearish structured area. That's between 15,265 and 15,370. The high today, 15,376. That's suggesting to us that the rally is likely over. Now, I'm not saying that we're going to see a big move to the downside, but likely we're going to see sideways action ish for the rest of the day. U.S. dollar index looks like it may confirm a Gartley sell pattern. If we get a bearish reversal candle, that's what we have right now. That suggests we had lower. Now, the first lower spot would be 102.28. If we look at Goldilocks, Goldilocks is still trading below its bot the bottom of its daily profile, just barely. The bottom's at 1925.60. Price trading at 1924.10. Nonetheless, if gold is going to get some bullish action, it needs to get back inside that profile. Silver, both gold and silver have A to B equals CD. To the downside patterns, golds one to one gets you to 1848. Silvers get you to uh, 2123. But first, silver would have to bust through the bottom if it's a uh, profile level. That's out at 2255. Just good old fashioned consolidation. Light sweet crew, and it should target the 7781 area. Natural gas having a nice rally. It was yesterday a bottom? We're going to try to figure that out during the Trader's Edge show. Folks, stay tuned. For the Trader's Edge Show, but if you have to start your Friday, have a fantastic one, a fantastic July 4th weekend. We'll look forward to either seeing you in just a few or on Wednesday. Wednesday, I'll be recording the show between 8 and 9. Take care, please.